These are the exact steps that I have used to make $20,000 online with minimal effort and no money out of pocket and then $100,000 offline and that's minimal effort, literally barely any money out of pocket. I'm going to show you guys the exact steps on how you can get paid to exist. So when you think about the concept of getting paid to exist, the first step is what do you enjoy? What do you have a passion for? What do you naturally gravitate towards, right? And my example is real estate. I got my real estate license in 2016. I had learned about it and I was like, I think I really want to do this. Nobody had to encourage me to do it. Nobody had to talk me into doing it. I naturally just wanted to learn about real estate. So much so that I was watching hours of real estate videos a day. Somebody was out there getting paid by giving me just a solution, right? I didn't have to pay for this solution they were getting paid by Google Ads and in return I was learning about real estate you need to find something whatever you do naturally already what do your friends come and talk to you about I do have a whole video I will link it down below on how to find out what you're passionate about once you do figure out what you're passionate about then you are gonna need to study studying is not gonna feel like studying I'm gonna say that right because you're getting paid to exist this is something that is naturally inside of you it doesn't even come across as studying me watching thousands of hours of real estate videos never came across as studying it was fun it was entertaining once you know what your passion is and you start studying on it you're going to figure out what area how to approach the situation so i love to give an example of like hair right or a barber so for example if you always were naturally into hair and now you, you want to study you're like how do i want to approach this hair thing maybe i want to start a shop or maybe i just want to start it out of a little salon or maybe do i want to go to people's house or do i just want to sell hair or do I just want to sell hair products. There's so many ways that you can approach it. So when I say study, you want to find out how you want to enter into your area of existence, basically, right? And then find people that are doing what you are interested in, that you respect and admire. And I would recommend somebody that's not so big. The reason why I say that is because being that you'll be starting out brand new, you want to find somebody who even on a smaller scale, the concepts are working. When it's a bigger channel or if it's a bigger like a celebrity or somebody and they come up with a product the chances of success are always going to be greater only because they already have a following but if you can basically study somebody who is into the existence that you want to get into the sector that you're trying to get into there's they're on a smaller scale they're not too small but they're on a smaller scale but their methods of communication, their methods of sharing, whether they're posting online or even marketing, emails or whatever the case might be, and it's working, you want to take note because success leaves clues. You probably always have heard this and that's going to give you an indication. So I'm going to give you guys an example. My very first YouTube video, mind you, my channel was honestly a fluke. It was just like I was playing and I was like, I got time. Like, let me just make this video. I think I saw a video on grants, business grants. Grants. And I was like, I could do this because I'm the type of person that if I'm going to do something, I'm going to try it out. I'm going to study on it. I'm telling you guys to study. I'm not just saying that because of anything. And I went and I, I saw a video. The lady was sharing grants. I said, I could do that. When you go to school, you have to write a paper. You have to do the research on the paper. I said, this is easy. I did a video. I studied on how to write your title, how to do your thumbnails, how to edit the video. My first YouTube video got 14 views and I was like, wow, right? The concept worked because if you think about it, I studied everything I was telling you guys about. I saw there was numbers, but it wasn't a huge channel. I think the lady's channel that I emulated was, I want to say maybe 60. She has 60 subscribers. I had zero subscribers. I used TikTok to grow my YouTube. That was like, because I studied all those things. So everything I'm telling you guys here is basically, it's something that I've done and something I continue to do. It's not just me saying it just because steps that allow me to make twenty thousand dollars just from the youtube platform from multiple streams when i say minimal effort i was recording on my iphone and i was editing my videos i probably had a total of about 20 videos that goes to show you that's what i mean by minimal effort because if somebody said you can make twenty thousand dollars making 22 youtube videos would you do it whatever you want to do these are the steps to follow so just keep following me here so the next one is going to be to lay out your plan and so when i say lay out your plan meaning when you do those two things and you find out who you want to emulate now you have to say okay how am i going to do it that's true to me always be true to yourself never be something that you're not people can see right through it you want to be honest you want to be transparent you want to be genuine right 
that's always how you're going to get the best results. Laying out your plan. If you want to do hair, I want to be a mobile braider. There's a local mobile braider in my area. This is how she markets. It's working for her. I'm going to see about doing that, but in my own way, that's honest to me, but there are elements from there that I have taken. For example, she maybe posts these type of Instagram posts. I'm going to do it by my own style. I'm going to have the same messaging that's true to me. I hope that makes sense. So for example, laying out my plan, I wrote out the videos that I wanted to do. I recorded the videos and then I executed the videos. I was monetized on YouTube within 90 days of doing this exact plan that I told you guys. The same thing with the real estate. I bought the house. Now my house has $100,000 of equity in it. I didn't do anything to get equity. The market is going to do what the market's going to do, right? It's just by me studying, laying out my plan, understanding my passion. You understand? The videos I was watching, I was taking notes. Okay, I could do that. I don't really want to do this like this. I'm going to do, I'm going to do it like this. This is what I'm comfortable with. I'm going to do it like this. So I hope that makes sense. And laying out the plan. Speaking of laying out the plan. So I have a project planner down below for you guys. So go ahead and download that and use the project planner. The project planner, if you're going to do whatever project you're going to do, lay out your goals, the schedules, the action steps. Actions are always important. Top tier. This video that I'm doing right now is literally me taking action and we're going to get into that. So make sure you subscribe. But action, taking action steps. And then the last thing is going to be accountability group. And if you have people, I know everybody doesn't, but if you have anybody around you that can help hold you accountable, even you holding yourself accountable, these are going to be great things that you can do in order to just stay on top of it. Me and my cousins did an accountability group, but even the real estate stuff that I was doing, they had their own projects going on and I was able to close out and finish that project. It was three of us. The other two have gone on to do great things with what they laid out. So accountability groups are big. I'm actually thinking about doing accountability group. Let me know if you guys are interested. Give me some feedback in the comments about accountability if you're interested because if I'm thinking about doing a group and we could just hold each other accountable, we can motivate each other. I think that would be really good. If you're interested or you have any feedback on that, maybe where I can host it like online where we could like talk daily, that would be great. So it's super simple. You can do it. There's nothing that you can't do. I believe in you guys. And like I have on my channel, you get what you focus on. So stay focused on what you want. And if that is to live a better life, if that's to make more money, if that's to get paid to exist, then go ahead and make it happen. I will talk to you guys later. And thank you so much for watching. Bye.